12 News starts right now with breaking news. That breaking news, fiery damage to a power pole knocking out power to thousands of people in two southern suburbs. You see the explosion there left homes and businesses in the dark. 3,100 people, in fact, in Franklin and Hale's Corners were without power in the height of the outage. That number is now down to 40 customers at this hour. WISN 12 News' Ben Hutchison is live at Target in Franklin, where customers were forced to shop in the dark. Yeah, they really were. And I can tell you right now out here in Franklin that the stoplights are working. You can see the stop sign out there. It was used when the power was out a little bit more than an hour ago. But We Energies tells 12 News around 3.30 in nearby Hales Corners, a damaged power pole caused widespread outages from Grange Avenue South to Drexel from 43rd to 122nd Street. We had some cell phone video sent in by a viewer. No word on when that will be fixed. Right now, about 40 customers are without power at the outage again. Peak 3,100 customers. Also, intercom radio stations couldn't broadcast. They are now back on the air. Now, I did go into that Franklin Target that we discussed there. They were without power for about an hour, but they never closed. They did have backup lighting working. The registers were rebooted so customers could continue shopping. It's very peaceful. It's just, you know, and people just walking around, and, you know, it, it didn't seem like a busy day. Just, just peaceful and dark, and people doing their thing. And the lights did come back on shortly before 5 at Target. The refrigerated section was actually taped off to prevent food from thawing. But again, right now, about 40 customers are without power right now. They're hoping that'll be fixed in the next couple of hours. In Franklin, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News.